I want to talk about something today that makes me very happy. I love making lists. I am a self-professed list maker. Whether it's a, a shopping list or a food shopping, a list of things that you need to do for the day, a to-do list. I get a great deal of satisfaction from taking things on the list. I don't know if that's just me or... But it makes me happy. Around three years ago, I made my first bucket list. And on that bucket list were quite big things. So I wasn't regularly ticking stuff off because I was working in London. Um, I was very busy all the time. I didn't have time or the money to take a trip to Fiji and drink Fiji water, which was one of the things on my list. However, the way that the list made me feel was still a great thing. I still I felt motivated knowing that you know in the back of my mind I had this, this list of goals that I was working towards. So last year in November time I decided to create a 17 for 2017 list. A list of 17 things that I wanted to accomplish before the end of the year. And I'd be lying if I said that I took everything off. But I did achieve some of them. So I crocheted a scarf, I ended up giving it to charity because I'm not currently in England and it's very hot where I am. I had a mother-daughter day with my mum, we did some DIY crafty stuff, uh, made a, a fairy tree top of the tree, Christmas tree. We made cookies and we drank champagne. I didn't achieve some of the things that were on my list because I kept putting them off, maybe they, I didn't have enough time to achieve them. But I didn't beat myself up about it. I still felt very positive about the, the list process because, again, it's at the back of my mind and it always makes me feel motivated. Like I'm, I'm working towards something, no matter how small it is. At the beginning of 2017, I decided to create a 25 before 25 list. I wanted to cook a meal, which sounds ridiculous, I'm sure, to a lot of people, but I can't cook. So that was a big thing for me. I did that and I ticked it off and I felt really good that I'd, I'd done something that I you know, hadn't previously done. I took a, a selfie with an elephant, which might seem like a big thing, but I already knew that I was going to Thailand for a week and during that time I was going to the elephant sanctuary. Uh, so I knew that was something that I could achieve. Learn to drive a scooter, learn a card trick. I want to read three more books before I turn 25. Um, I wanted to learn something from YouTube, so I, I looked up a tutorial and I learned how to make a an origami box, simple one, uh, but I did it. I liked the way that these lists were making me feel, so I decided to use a technique, mini goals, where I had um, a list. I usually choose ten things, but it can be three or five or four things, one a week that you want to achieve in the month. And they can be as small as take a walk. They can be as big as create a YouTube channel or something. You constantly have something to work towards. So you feel a sense of achievement every time you tick something on the list. I would love to know if anybody else already does this or would like to try it. If you like it, let me know. Bye.